Hey y'all, welcome back. I started my video, I got a couple minutes in and then this big giant fly thing came up here and I just had to go on attack with it to try to get it away from me. I'm ready, if it comes back, I'm going in the house. But anyway, I'm looking around all scared. I started the haul and um, anyway, I was showing y'all, I was talking about, yes, Texas thrift stores have opened back up. Department stores, malls and things like that has not opened back up yet. Um, you know, Big Lots was open. Uh, Target and Walmart and all that's never closed. Um, Kroger, you know, all our grocery stores, they didn't close. Um, but like Ross, Marshalls, all of that home goods, World Market, none of that has opened back up. Michaels is open. Home goods is open. Home, I mean, not home goods. Um, Hobby Lobby just opened back up uh, yesterday, Friday, May 1st. Um, but they have only been closed for three weeks. They didn't close right away. You know, they closed after a while. But all this, the thrift stores are open. Only one I haven't heard from is St. Vincent's. It's the only one I haven't heard about yet. But most of the other ones are open with restricted hours and restrictions. I know Grace Bridge, I did go there, and you must wear a mask. I did step into Goodwill, and you do not have to have them on a mask. I saw people in there without masks on. Um, I didn't stay long in either store. I really just didn't want anything. I keep hearing my door. I didn't um, want anything, and I didn't need anything, so I didn't do it. I, now, Wednesday, I went to Salvation Army. I think they opened Monday. So, I did go in there, and again, they have restrictions, too. They have restricted hours, um, and uh, did I see people in there without a mask? I don't know. I can't even remember if I saw people in there without a mask. But anyway, I wanted to show y'all this. I had got this prior to the shutdown. Um, and it, this was in the trunk of my car. I, I thought I didn't buy it, but I did. You remember these slap chap chops? They do this to your vegetable. You put the onion in there or whatever vegetable and, and it chops it. I got one. It was 99 cents. It was uh, $1.99 blue and I got a half off. And then I thought when I didn't see it in my hall, I was like, oh, I must have put it back. But no, I had it. It just fell out of my bag. Okay, and this too, I saw, um, oh, I cannot remember your name. You know who you are, girl. One of my subscribers on here, I saw her in the uh, store, and I, this, that's when I get, this is how long ago it was. Oh, well over a month. I just forgot to show you. I'm getting ready to do a DIY on it. It's a golfer. Now, I told you the guest room, I'm doing that world traveled look, and kind of, I had the horses and all of that, the big statues, and I'm painting them all, all one color. I, I decided I think I might be doing it matte black. I'm not sure. Because the bookcases are white. So I don't know what I'm going to do yet. But I am getting ready to put a coat of white paint on here. So whatever I you know, paint it, it'll take better. Look at him. He's a cute little golfer. So I'm looking at this. And a little flare. It's breezy out here today. Alright. Then this I got from Goodwill yesterday. And I know you say why. Because it's a size. The size is XXL. I only wanted it for fabric. Look at that. Isn't it pretty? Hobby Lobby. Um, I don't want y'all blowing nowhere. Hobby Lobby uh, sold out of the other one that I was using. and um, But I got this because I, I thought I would use this for a picture. Um, so I, I brought these three 16 by 20. Well, I, I didn't pick them up yet. I got to pick them up at Target. 16, 16 by 20 inch frames. And I thought, wouldn't it be nice to put some lemon in there? I don't know. We'll see. But that's why I got that. It's a whole lot of fabric. So. And it was $5. Not on sale. $5.15. Not on sale. But it's about a yard of fabric. So. Um, okay. Then I'll show you Grace Bridge. Because that's, that's what I got yesterday. I got this. Is this cute or what? Now this um, is a scuttle. Coal scuttle. It's a um, antique brass slash maybe uh, copper. Under I don't know that um, when you look online, you see copper and brass when with these. So I don't know, but um, it has the blue Delph um, handles on it, and it was twelve ninety nine half price, so six fifty. Yesterday, hobby I mean um, Grace Bridge had fifty percent off mostly everything in the store. I don't think clothes, but everything else. So, look at this, how big this is. It's big, it comes, this part from floor to here comes to about my knee. So, not bad. Um, and you know what I saw this for? A vase, right? So, put some big, pretty wildflowers in. 
um, for something, or either it could be an umbrella stand, right? Either or. I mean, I ain't scuttling no uh, coal, <laughs> but it could be a, a, you know, wildflower vase, just some flowers sitting out, or a, like I said, an umbrella holder for six fifty for the bed. And um, then I'm a, now I'm at. Oh no! And I got some jewelry jars. I got three. They don't appear to be anything exciting. I'll probably open one up later on this evening. And they're heavy to lift, and I left them in there. So I got three of them from Goodwill. Goodwill never has. Oh, here's one. Oh no, it ain't. That's not it. This is what what I got from St. Vincent's. I mean, I said St. Vincent's. Um, Salvation Army on. This is Wednesday. I want Wednesday. Look at this. Would you look at that? Now, I do not know this pattern. And I don't know who it's by yet. But I will be looking it up. It's actually a candle holder, you see? It's really pretty. It kind of reminds me of those uh, um, anniversary glasses that I had got. The ones that was like $175 for the pair. This lead crystal is beautiful beautiful piece see the ridging in there i'm gonna look it up and see but i got a set of two it wasn't a set they were 199 a piece and they were green tags and i don't think that nothing was on sale at salvation army nothing except for friends and family stuff so clothes bags and accessories was half off but no houseware or anything like they didn't have a color tag and then i got Oh, this set here. I said, oh, this would be it. This is, you know, my famous uh, one-piece setting. When I set the table for myself. All right, y'all, I might have to try to get this open. Let me see. Can I? I can't. And I sure it. Nope. Let me see if I can get one of these bracelets to open it. I'm Wonder Woman. You know how she uses her bracelet as a tool and her thing. <laughs> I'm a mess. Yep, and it's working too. The point on here is to break the tape. One second, because I, I need to show you this, the way to, uh, oop, the print in here. Okay, here's a bowl. This is separated. Do you see the um, etching on there? The floral? Is that gorgeous, right? And then, here is a saucer slash whatever, right? And then you have the largest two-handle dinner plate same and I don't know who it is yet but with the help of my friends on here and me searching on Google we won't figure it out so if y'all know anything about this I'm gonna show you that print again look at that look at the roses in there y'all I will set I will do this for a breakfast in a minute could you imagine my my fruit in here and then whatever if I have a slice of toast I found some good bread that's good for uh, carbohydrates. I mean, like, I'll have one piece, two pieces if I'm having a sandwich. I want to say it's 13 or 14 carbs for two slices. It's not good, but it beats air, you know? So, um, so I will, now I have, I want to make some avocado toast. That's what I wanted today. But I'm going to see how that, you know, because if you mask the taste, it's not too bad. I wouldn't want to eat it by itself. But I'll have that, some eggs some avocado toast or something and um breakfast and i'll sit right out here with this and be sitting in luxury and this my friends was it wasn't on sale of course it was what was it 3.99 for the set of three for that whole set 3.99 not bad yeah i got that so look for that coming soon i'm still working on that other table that i should put the uh I found a well I have a bunch of them because when I first moved here I was going bananas finding the saris and um in the thrift stores for like a dollar and I have so many pretty ones but that royal blue caught my eye yesterday okay so then I got this this is a crossbody I actually have another one but it's like a messenger this is a crossbody with a little pocket on it, it looks like it's had some wear but it's long shop and these are good for uh you know carry bags just to have, it has a little bit of bubbling on the back, but it's, this bag is for, it's a forever bag. It's nice. And this was half price of $4.99, so it was $2.50. I got it. I 
have the matching messenger to this. It's somewhere. I just got to locate it. It's packed away. But I have the exact messenger bag that matches that. And then, um, what else did I get with that? Okay, then the last thing I got, oh no, I think I got one more thing other than this. But I'm going to show you all these because I got two sets of these. And I don't, they had four, but I didn't need four because, okay, so I kind of want to off. Look at this bowl. This is by Crate and Barrel 2, CB2, right? Um, it's just an extra bowl because I didn't really want it. Didn't need it. But I got two of these on each one. This is hearth and hand, right? Hearth and hand. Look at that. Irregular shape. Now, if you remember the berry bowls I showed yesterday in my Hobby Lobby haul. And also, I showed uh, something else. Um, oh, the, the bunny. The what, black and white bunny plates. Look. And I have... So, in each set, I got that freight and barrel bowl that didn't match. And I realized it. So, I just only got two sets because each set gave you two salad plates. And they were $4.99. And they were on sale. So I got for five dollars. I got two salad plates and two dinner plates in this. Um, hearth and hand. I'm, I'm trying to pull this out without drawing the neck. This tape got these things stuck. Okay. So look at the plate, and these are hearth and hand. Like I said, it came from Target. You know the uh, what's her name? Joanna Gaines. Look at that. Right? So imagine this and then my bunny plate. Easter. Right? And then I would do everything else up in whites with probably like a pink or um, jadeite color as an accent. Right? So that jadeite green as an accent. And I got two sets like this. So it's going to give me these two bowls extra, which I wouldn't use with it because I would never do black, black, black. No. You got to mix that up. And probably when I use the bunny plates... They're about the same size as this. So I would just use the black plate, the bunny plate, and then probably throw in some jadeite with, uh, you know, because I think the black, the, that green would be pretty bad. So they were $4.99, not on sale. And I got five pieces in each set, which gave me two dinner, I mean, four dinner plates, four salad plates, and then two dumb bowls. So for $10, I got that. So I got them. But that black is something in that irregular organic shape. I can do a lot with that. So I can mix it with that black and white, but I can mix it with just about anything, really. Okay, then what else was in here? This. this. I don't even remember what it is. Um, oh, I got this. Ain't that cute? <laughs> just a big, giant Starbucks mug. And I got this for resale. I'm going to resell this. They sell good. So it was $1.99. I know I could probably get a couple bucks for it. So I got it for resale purposes. And, um, and then what is that? Yo. Whew, your girl can't be twisting her body like that. I'm going to be live in a few. Um, oh, I got these. Look at this. This is Noritake. Would you look at that? And it is flower, flower time. I got two. They had three, but they were $2.99 a piece because it wasn't marked. The guy said $2.99. I got two because I said, you know what? It'll be outside. Again, breakfast. I'll mix this with the green plates, yellow plates. I have the yellow. Um, There's almost this color in the um, Fiesta wear. And I also have a nice deep green. Too. And I have some right over there that match perfect. Right over that I keep for outside. It match perfect with this from Dollar Tree. So I got two of those. That's it. And then um, it's the coffee mug, vintage. Oh, you know I love these uh, prints. Well, you don't know if you ain't watched me before, but if you watch me, you would know. So handle, you know, little short coffee mug and or tea mug and the print bowl. And then, you know, a nice breakfast or lunch type of, uh, mix it with one of those green plates from Dollar Tree. Or like I said, any kind, Fiesta wear. Nice little setting. And I think that's it. Because yeah, the only thing I got at um, Goodwill 
was that skirt and the free jewelry jar. That was it. So, oh my, the um, outside got me going today with my nose. But I'll be live tonight, 7.30, Saturday, May 2nd. So I'll be live at 7.30. Um, I might show one of those jewelry jars, and then we'll just chit-chat for a minute. I was just on Raquel's live. Um, if it ain't cheap, I'm not buying it. Um, and we were just talking, and I, we were talking about different things. And I was talking about going to Vegas, and she was saying she wanted to go. So, she's looking into flights for those dates, which would be nice. A few other people were on there, wonderfully wonderfully made, and uh, Wendy, always busy. She was on there. She was talking about it. So, guys, if you're interested, it's going to be October now. It's not going to be a planned out thing. I'm not doing a whole bunch of planning. I'm, telling, I'm going to be there from October 5th to October 9th. I will be there. Um, um, I actually get there late on the 5th. So, technically, the 6th, 7th, and 8th. And half of the night, I'll be there. So I just want to do a little fun. I'm, I'm not going there for gambling. Y'all know I don't do casinos and gambling. And I'm not a night lifer. So I'm going for more like the day life of Vegas. And um, October won't be so cold. Flights were, my, I got my flight for $74 round trip. Yeah. So they're real cheap. Book in advance and get it cheap. And like I said, I got a room at the Tropicana for $44 a night. Um, but there's a $45 a night resort fee that you don't pay till you get there and i paid my book my room and paid for that with the um for the 44 dollars but when you get there you pay the hotel the resort fee so i say resort resort wait how do you say it resort resort fee right whatever um so i'll probably pay it prior but i hear there's some talks of they might be trying to cancel that out so i'm not paying it right now i want to wait and see what happens See if they're trying to stimulate their economy and then i won't have to pay it so we'll see once i get there um but right now if you're looking into um booking especially the fl flight and every day that goes by they're starting to go up the whole calendar is filled back in i'm using frontier airlines um and um so you got to look for where you're at to see what's flying out closest to you frontier isn't everywhere um so you might want to check Spirit or Southwest. Now, I am going to eventually buy a uh, pay for luggage. I have, haven't done that yet. That's not included in the $74 that I paid for the ticket. I will add that because I'm not going to October. I got months to wait for a deal. And then once I see a deal, like if they have a special, I snatch it up. You know, because I just bought for my August trip to Jersey, I just bought a perks package for $66 round trip. Um, both way no sixty six dollars going and sixty six dollars coming. So it was one twenty, one twenty something, one twenty four, and um, so I get a check bag. I can, you know one that I the big one that you check and let them take one carry on, which is that other smaller one, the twenty by twenty four or something, and then you get a personal, which I normally carry a big bag and I'll put my laptop and my iPad and whatever else I'm taking. Um, my phones and all of my gadgets and jewelry and stuff like that. I throw that in my, um, you know, personal bag. Plus you get your carry on, plus you get, and you get the perks, which is you go through the speedy checkout, check in, and then, you know, both ways. Well, so I added that for a hundred because I brought my ticket last month. When that special popped up, I said, I'll add an extra hundred and something, um, for that. So that's where my August trip, August trip is done. July. I only brought, only purchased my seats. So I have to wait until I get a good package for that one. And I'm not, I don't, I'm not, I don't think I'm going to do too much shopping in July. So I might only get a, a carry-on to go. I'm only going to be there for seven days. In August, I'll be there for like 13 days in Jersey. So I don't know. We'll see. I'm going to look and see what pops up. That's how I do it. So, and then for Vegas, I'll add you know, whatever I want to add eventually. But to buy the ticket and have it set, is it was only cost me $74 round trip. All right, am I talking about travel agency stuff or what? <laughs> Let me get off of here. All right, y'all, I'll be back soon. I'll see you. I'm going to go on here, eat a sandwich, and get myself ready for uh, tonight. I'll chit-chat with you guys later. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and leave me some comments, and I'll chit-chat with you soon. Bye-bye.